Hey, this is Alex Power with My Creative Cinema. In today's tutorial, I will show you a basic color grading for beginner filmmakers in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. Stay with me, we'll be right back. Welcome to another tutorial. Today, I will show you basic color grading for beginners in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. Let's get started. I have three clips here on my timeline. First one is filmed on a DJI Osmo that I mounted on the car. It has a really nice blue sky and I set this to neutral in order to color grade on the post production. And the second one is in the Berkeley a clip from the wedding, couple walking and I'm just following them with a stabilizer on GH4 and I shot this with Cine, Cine like D which is a light log too. So the next one is uh, the couple's great entrance during the wedding and uh, it's shot on a GH4 as well with Cine like D. Very similar to Canon Cine style so it has a little more saturation than the Cine style but still it's uh, enough for you to color grade and um, do some color correction if, when needed. First thing we will do, we'll go ahead and create a new item and that's going to be adjustment layer. And we'll drop right on top of all the clips and we'll extend this. That way it will color grade all three clips together at once and if we need to make some adjustments we can go individually to each clip and change it if it's too dark or too light we can play with that so just click on this adjustment layer and um, let's start with let's just for the sake of the tutorial start with the first one okay we'll just click on the adjustment layer and we'll go to the color tab here okay we'll change everything so uh, what you can do here, you can apply a loot, but today's tutorial is not about how to color grade with the loot. We are gonna actually try to color grade with the tools we have here. And we have a saturation here. We can add a little bit of that. We can get some uh, colors here, change it a little bit to orange, highlight this, let's say. A uh, little bit more contrast, less highlights, and play with the shadows and whites. Uh, bring the blacks a little bit more. And let's see. And we can also go ahead and go to the curves. You can play with the colors here individually. Let's say you want to change this one that's the brightness but it brings that depth you know to the picture and we'll go to the red color and we will just leave it there and a green maybe right here and the blue it's super nice to highlight that thing also color wheels you can play with that meat tones bring a little bit more blue now we'll probably leave this right here you can basically you can create any mood for your video let's say if you're creating some sort of a short film or any documentary that you wanna give to a viewer a certain feeling about your movie about your short film there is a creative tab here and that's already built in looks here there's a bunch of them so you can go ahead and play with that too find the right one that you think it's good for you and let's say this one see that's too much so you go to intensity here and you bring this back and uh, I think that that's the one I like we, you can scroll through that to find the ones you want to actually do and they will uh, some of them will emulate the film look and you will have a Kodak or Fuji um, look uh, like it's been filmed on the 
actual um, 16 millimeter or super 35 or super 16 or even 8 millimeter but that's another tutorial for that how to emulate this look so let's just stay on that thing and uh, saturation I want to put a little more saturation here vibrance and let's say that's the look I want to I want to have let's just go back to editing and watch this clip how that goes all right it looks nice looks really good to me let's look at the second clip and see if there's any changes to that one huh look at that we'll just remove that for a second okay we'll go to that clip okay see this is the look right now this is the look we have right now and this is the one was before so see how saturated it is so we just went from this all the way to this in a few simple steps it's not that complicated to make your footage look cinematic and fun and uh, transfer certain feelings or transfer a certain mood for your video or for your film so let's get to the next one this one seems too dark to me so I would go to this one not the actual adjustment layer I would go to the scene I have here and the actual clip I will go to the color tab back and let's see I go to basic correction and I'll bring a little bit of exposure basically you play with the light here mostly that's what you do and I want a little bit of blue okay I want a little different look and highlights I want to bring highlights a little bit and basically you play with that until you satisfy with what you see let's take a look all right that's what I like I, I would like to highlight that green that around the couple and that that's pretty looks pretty good to me so I would leave this alone right now and we will go to the next clip and we'll do the same thing see that's too yellow right now here we go to this clip and we'll put more blue we'll put at the exposure we'll play with that a little bit contrast highlights and we'll get rid of that you know saturation if we go more it will create even more yellow look so we'll just get we can get and um, uh, you can play a little more with other stuff but let's see how that looks it was before and it's after before and after okay let's just play that and see that's the atmosphere that's the look I wanted to create people the guests are cheering for the couple and all right it looks nice the colors are popping up too I like this color grading right now so yeah and again here people faces are too yellow some rolling shutter see uh, you can adjust that you can go ahead and like put more little blue roll in and see it it fix it fix the problem so the skin has normal color right now okay perfect and let's check all the clips before and after go back to editing and we will go to clip by clip so this is the clip was how it looked before and this is after this one was before and this is after brings more saturation brings more color brings more life to your footage and the third one okay let's see let's stop right here 
okay happy moment okay we'll remove that see it's completely washed out all the color is completely washed out and when you bring that back you know create some atmosphere create create a certain look and this is going to be the end of the tutorial Don't forget to comment and tell me how do you color grade your footage. And if you find this video helpful, please like, subscribe and support the channel on social media. I will see you next time.